All right, y'all, it's AGP here, and it's Friday. So you know it's time for another AGP video. <laughs> so um, earlier I did a reaction to the Inside the Gameplay trailer for The Last of Us Part 2. I also did an Inside the Story one, so if y'all want to go check those out, you're more than welcome. I'll have the links down in the description if you want to check those out. But this is about the new equipment or PS4 Pro that we will be seeing that will be coming out at some point in the future. But I'll let you know that'll be the last thing I say here because there's three other things that are coming. One is kind of combined with it, but you know, whatever. So the first thing is they they teamed up with Seagate to create a two terabyte hard drive slash game drive. It has a laser etched design of Ellie's tattoo, which seems to be kind of the symbol of the game, if you will, much like the Firefly in the first one. Your system does have to be up to date, so 4.50 or higher and it'll cost $90, so it's not cheap. But it's two terabytes, so it's a decent amount of space. It's a lot of space, actually. They say it can hold 50 games now. That's, of course, if the games don't take up as much memory as Call of Duty Modern Warfare or even The Last of Us Part Two, which is 100 gigs. So, yeah, that'll be lit, though. list for Last of Us Part 2 limited edition goods are a pair of Sony PlayStation Gold wireless headphones. Yes, yeah, so they have, they come in a steel matte black finish like pretty much all the other equipment and it has Ellie's fern tattoo etched in on one side and it has the Last of Us Part 2 logo on the other side. It has crimson inner ear cups and it will be $100 in the US and it will be $120 in Canada. So if y'all want those, y'all might have to go ahead and get those as quickly as possible. So next up, which is something that you probably would have guessed already, is the limited edition Last of Us Part 2 DualShock 4 controller. Now this has the logo, the Last of Us Part 2 logo on the touchpad, and it has Ellie's Fern tattoo etched in on the left side of the controller, which will be all right because it's facing us. It'll have white detailing and PlayStation shapes, and it'll cost $65 in the US and $75 in Canada. And if y'all are interested in that, you should go get that if you just want the controller. It does look cool. Matte finish does look kind of cool. It just looks nice, but you know, it's, it's dope. So yeah. For the last thing that y'all have been waiting for this last three to four minutes for is the limited edition Last of Us Part 2 PS4 Pro. It is coming in a matte black finish like the rest of the items that we saw. It has Ellie's fern tattoo on it, as you can see here, and it will be costing $400 in the US and $500 in Canada. It comes with the physical copy of Last of Us Part Two and a digital download code for all the pre-order content, which was the night and day theme with Ellie and some avatars. But it also says that it comes with more, but they didn't clarify what that more was just yet. So I'm sure we will find that out when it's time. But you know, it'll be launching on June 19th 2020 the same day as the game so if you want to pre-order it you should go grab your copy now if you have the breath for it go get it and uh you know you'll have a special edition last was part two ps4 pro Catch y'all next time. I, if y'all want to check out my reaction to the Inside the Story trailer, the Inside the Gameplay trailer, then you should go check those out. I'll have them in the end screen and the links in the description. I'm going to catch y'all next time. I right, Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'm out. All right. Peace. Okay.